Zealuct Fire Leaves 8 Homeless, Guyana Fire Service Issues Safety Tips Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Tonight, we bring you a heartbreaking story from Zealuct, East Bank Essequibo, where eight individuals are now homeless after a devastating fire. According to reports, the fire broke out at Health Center Street, Zealuct, sparked by an overheated drop cord. This tragic incident has left families displaced and in need of support. The two-story wooden and concrete house, owned by 33-year-old Dioraj Jagernoth, was completely gutted by the flames. Jagernoth, along with his family of four, lived in the house, along with tenants Felix Lindor, Lorena Lopez, and Fajales Valentino. The Guyana Fire Service responded swiftly to the emergency, arriving within minutes of the fire's ignition. Despite their efforts, the fire consumed the entire structure, leaving nothing but ashes behind. Not only did the fire destroy Jagernoth's home, but it also caused radiated heat damage to a nearby house owned by Parbati Sochand and occupied by her and Ravish Tadas. In light of this tragic event, the Guyana Fire Service has issued important fire safety tips to help prevent similar incidents in the future. Firstly, regularly inspect electrical cords for fraying or damage. Avoid overloading outlets and power strips. Install smoke detectors and test them regularly. Have a fire extinguisher on hand and know how to use it. Install surge protectors to safeguard electronic devices. Keep flammable materials away from electrical appliances. Hire a professional for any electrical repairs or installations. Replace damaged or outdated wiring promptly. Use appropriate wattage for light bulbs in fixtures. And finally, unplug appliances when not in use to prevent potential hazards. Our hearts go out to the families affected by this tragic fire. Let's come together to support them in any way we can. Remember, fire safety is everyone's responsibility. Thank you for watching. Stay safe, and we'll see you in the next video.